What's going on there folks, Earthmaster here, October 15, 2019, 1.30 p.m. West Coast time. We've got another earthquake coming along here uh, in the West Coast region. A 4.7 occurring near the Ridgemark area near uh, Tres Pinos, California. Looks like a 4.7 magnitude earthquake just striking here a short time ago. Uh, this comes after a 4.5 that struck the Bay Area to the north uh, just uh, last night. Now this new earthquake activity is right smack dab on the San Andreas Fault system here. Um, the activity last night was not. It was a ways away from the San Andreas Fault. But this one right here uh, definitely taking place on the San Andreas Fault system here. Uh, so this just re reaffirms my suspicion of the activity that's continuing out here along the west coast uh, with the pressure and whatnot um, up and down the entire west coast right now. Uh, like I said, right smack dab on that red line, right smack dab on the San Andreas Fault System here. A depth of about 9.7 uh, kilometers below the surface here, so a little bit more shallow than the one that struck last night in the Bay Area. Um, so yeah, definitely be on guard out there uh, this evening, this, this afternoon. I guess there is a small percentage, uh, if you look at these earthquakes, of something bigger happening. Um, but it uh, it's only got a, like a, a small hour, a, a small window of opportunity, like ranges from 12 to 24 hours, I believe, uh, is what those professionals claim, um, that where we could see a larger earthquake. But, you know, we could see a larger earthquake um, without notice. I mean, these could be precursors. They could be... Uh, you know, four shocks to something major down south, you know, further down south. Who knows? Um, let's go ahead and show you one more map right here since I got the maps up here in view. And this here is just the Caltech website um, showing the last 24 hours or last uh, last day, I guess. No, last week of activity. There we go. Red squares indicating the last day or last hour, I should say. And... Um, yeah, that's at 4.7 that just struck here. You can see Hollister on the map to the south a little bit, or to the north, I should say. I'm all mixed up today. And uh, this one taking place, like I said, right near the Ridge Mark area. Ridge Crest is further down south where that activity happened uh, on July 4th, July, July 5th. But uh, Ridge Mark uh, is pretty close to where this activity just took place today so be on alert out there folks i am running the live stream uh 24 7 with current information coming into the seismographs here i was not here when it uh when the 4.7 struck but there was no doubt that uh, it probably registered uh fairly nicely on uh, quite a few of those stations there so anyway uh play safe out there everyone have a backup plan uh for just in case you lose power uh, during an earthquake, uh, make sure you got plenty of water and whatnot, and uh, necessities uh, for your family and and, uh, and yourself. So, stay safe out there, uh, and we will keep you guys updated on any new earthquake activity occurring out here on the West Coast and also worldwide. So, stay safe.